It's Python on Hardware time. Okay, every single week we talk about all the things on hardware that happens to run Python. We have a newsletter. It's Adafruit Daily. You can go to adafruitdaily.com. It's completely separate from your store account because we don't like to mix the two because your personal information is yours. We don't spam or do anything like that. So. Um, we're going to show a video, which is a little bit of a preview on the M7, but we also have a bit of news. The CircuitPython 8.1.0 beta has been released. Lidiata, what is the latest and greatest that people okay. should consider, test, and more that'll help them out and us? We still have um, animated GIF support. It's still kind of in progress of being tested, um, but it's still kind of neat if you want to try loading uh, small GIFs from disk and displaying them on a TFT display. Um, should work on OLEDs or color TFTs. Uh, we've got um, support for um, seven inch ink displays and we do like auto dithering within of them. And that's part of also the, the palette stuff. A lot of, it's mostly actually been a lot of bug fixes to be honest. Well, for um, a major release, that's usually- but Yeah, we have a huge churn of bugs. Uh, keep yeah. finding them, posting them. It's a circuit Python GitHub repo and we will uh, check them out. Also, you know, we get usually a lot more um, new users with a new major release. And so that will also kind of uh, get some exciting um, new bug reports coming in. And then um, in CircuitPython news, the M7, uh, we're working hard at it to get CircuitPython stuff going. So we have a video. Um, I was going to put this top secret, but I think it's fine. I think it's fine. This is, this is kind of nice, good python -y news because we have a very cool new board. So take it away, Jeff. Hi, Jepler here with another quick video. This is the beta version of the uh, Adafruit Metro M7 board in that um, Arduino compatible form factor that many of us love so much. And the final version of the board is in the store now. There's a lot of stuff for us to add to CircuitPython before that is um, moved out of alpha release quality. And so to get my fingers, to get my toes wet, <laughs> excuse me, um, I picked Rotary I.O which means I need to know about how GPIO pins work and pin muxing and pin interrupts. And just to show that the proof of the pudding is in the eating, as I rotate this knob, the onboard NeoPixel will cycle through the spectrum of colors. So that's what I've been working on, and you should keep your eye out for more improvements to our support for the uh, IMXRT family of microcontrollers in CircuitPython 8.1 and uh, later on CircuitPython 9. Yeah, it delivered every single week to your inbox, adafruitsdaily.com is where you sign up.